Okay, everybody, I just put the stuff in. You see the temperature? My humidity is probably off a little bit. If you look there. Yeah, it's still a little high, but it's still getting regulated. But uh, I collected them. Uh, there's 41 eggs. There's enough for 42. But that one there can't be in because the motor gets in the way. If you had smaller eggs, that's that would probably work. Bantam eggs or quail eggs would be no issue. Matter of fact, you can put two quail eggs in each of these little openings. So... But that's all I did. I collected them for a few days and put them on, turn it on. Now, like I said, I got to keep this off most of the time, uh, but I check it in the morning and night, the humidity, and then I use this to regulate it. If I need to hold it in, put it in partial. Most of the time it's in that partial stage, like I said the other video. That's it with this uh, Hova Bader incubator. Unbelievably good, unbelievably easy to use especially if you got the egg turner. So that's it for this second part of this video on how to make the eggs here, and uh, we'll let you go.